I was surprised, frankly, because I think that there's been a lot of gamers and developers sort of saying for a long time, this is what we want, this is what we want, and it seems like Nintendo sort of heard the voices of the hardcore gamer. The thing I was most surprised about the new controller was the ability for it to stream content wirelessly to the controller. I like sitting in bed playing games on like a DS, for instance. I like playing games on touchscreens. I always sort of ex accept the fact that those games aren't going to be full kind of hardcore gaming experience that I'd expect out of a modern out of a modern console. But now, for somebody to tell me like, "Hey, you could have that experience, but you could have that experience streamed with the lights off to a monitor, a handheld monitor, you know, when your wife's asleep next to you with some headphones on, to have that um, a full hardcore gaming experience." That's something I hadn't really seen before. You know, developing the first Bioshock and then you know developing Bioshock Infinite, we didn't even know what the power of the core gaming console would give us. The graphics gave us the ability to create a world that was more believable. And the fact that you could just have that kind of density in the world. And all of a sudden that led us to a kind of storytelling. I think when any new technology comes along, you have this period of experimentation where I'm certainly excited about it as a gamer. Um, and you know, seeing what's going to come out for that.